Heidi Hill, Arkansas Pilgrim here again with a quick yard tip, yard, gardening, whatever. Uh, and it's actually maybe late in the season for this, but uh, maybe it'll come in handy next spring. Or maybe now, if uh, you're running late like I am, I recently split a bunch of firewood. And when I was done, uh, I had a pretty big pile of bark from from the logs and some sawdust and stuff from where I'd cut it into into links. Um, well, instead of burning that into in a pile, I decided to make mulch out of it using my lawnmower. Okay. Here's kind of the area where I've actually already done it. There's no sense. I mean, you know how to use a lawnmower. I don't have to show you how to do that. But you can see there's a lot of little shreds left. But what I did as I put the mower on lowest possible setting, you can see it's pretty low to the ground. And I just ran over it back and forth a whole bunch. And obviously, uh, it's best to have a bag for it. But uh, you can always, if you don't, you can always just rake it up when it's done. And once let's see here here we go this here it is and i'll show you the pile i've got right here there you go bunch of well you probably can't see it that well with the lighting but hey bad lighting that's one of the ways you know you're on arkansas pilgrims channel but there you go see here anyway a big pile of shredded bark and it's mostly bark it's not wood chips uh, wood chips especially on oak can be kind of hard you don't want to beat up your lawnmower but uh anyway there you go instead of having to go buy a bunch of mulch you can make if you're already cutting your own firewood there you go hope this helps remember do what you can with what you have where you are god bless y'all and see you next time